Hi guys and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I'll be okay. right back, guys. I'm back. I just took care of uh, the enemies here in this area, so yeah, I think that's okay. Almost okay, done. back after that. All right, let's pick up some treasure, huh? What is that? Monsters are causing the desertification here. What a pain. You said it, Magus. What a pain. Alright. So let's um, pick up this treasure. Muscle ring. I'll tell you what all this stuff does after. Bum bum. Because we got a fight coming up here. You gotta chase him down. There we go. Alright. Now my party is different because this guy is immune to all sorts of magic attacks. So yeah. Awesome. Magus is going to be my ice caster. So go to it. And let's do confuse and yeah, we'll do that. Defense power is down. All right. We should keep up this pace, and we should be doing pretty darn well for ourselves. Yeah, you want to keep on um, doing the ice. Trust me. Every turn, every turn. Uh, I have Magus equipped with the um, gold stud. I should have switched everyone else's equipment around. I didn't do that. I forgot. Oh well. We'll see how this battle goes. Ice. Confuse. You want to hit him with very strong physical attacks. As I said, magic really does nothing. At least that I... At least ice and fire doesn't. I'm not even going to try luminaire or shadow. I'm not. Physical is the way to go. Take him out. Booyah. Yeah, I've been trying Ace's hack. I've been trying to beat that level off screen for so long. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know if I'll ever get back to it. Uh, well, we'll see. I'll keep on trying to beat it. Wouldn't that be fun? Anyways, yeah, we defeated the top half. Yay, top half is dead. All right, you keep absorbing that energy. Yeah, we. It's dead. Running wild without its core, or something like that. I don't know. Runs away when the core is lost. There we go. Okay. We got all that nice stuff. Huh. All right. So that's that for this boss, I guess. You know, he was rather e more easy than I thought he was going to be. Pick that up. Power tab. So we are done. Alright, I need Robo in my uh, party for this scene anyways. Thank you for routing the beast. Unfortunately, it'll take centuries to revive the forest. I wish I could live long enough to see my wish come true. You can come for me when the job is done. May I stay behind and help her? Yes. You, wanna, you want Robo to help her out. Alright, so let's head back to the future. I said let's head back to the future so we can reunite with him. Look at him, he's plowing the land. Oh, I hit the wrong button. There we go. And then um, every time you like come in and out of a house or something, he's like either seeding or being a scarecrow or watering it. Something like that. Look at the whole forest grew. Sweet. Ah, there's Robo. Man, he does. He looks the worst for wear, doesn't he? Ah, but he's still active. 
Systems reactivated. Where am I? Ah, uh, Magus, how nice to see you. For you, here's a quick hop, but for me, 400 long years have passed. The effort was worth it. The forest has grown back. Now let us celebrate our 400th year reunion. After 400 years of experience, I've come to think that Lavos may not be responsible for the gates. What do you mean? I've come to think that someone or something wanted us to see all this. The different events over time that we have witnessed, it's almost as if some entity wanted, us, wanted to relive its past. Look, you know, when people die, elders say, see whole life pass by. Tis true that mortals do relive their most profound memories before death claimeth them. Yet those memories most often are sad ones. Thinking of things like, if only I had done this, or I shouldn't have done that, triggers unpleasant old memories. Will that happen when our time comes? Probably. Who knows? Is there a point in time you'd want to return to, Luca? No, not really. I'm sorry. Was that something I shouldn't have asked? It's okay. It's just something I don't like to talk about too much. Lavos plays an integral role in the fortunes of this entity. So who is this entity? Hmm. It is unknown whose memories these are. It may be something beyond our comprehension. Our journey may come to an end when we finally discover the identity of the entity. Shall we turn in for the night? It's kind of an in interesting scene there. Some people believe that it's the planet reliving its memories. I don't know. Anyways, hmm. Luca, take control of Luca, everyone's sleeping. Let's head over here. There's a gate. A red gate. Huh. Let's go in. Alright, I want to make sure I do this right, so I'm going to save state it. Did I make it back to that moment? The prompts go ahead and do look into this work. I hate sign. I loathe it. Okay, let's go. This is Lucas' house. Okay, nothing over there. What about in here? Password is the name of my lovely wife. Using an emergency to ban. Okay. Well, we know the name of his wife is Laura. So. What is this thing? Tavan says to keep away from it, but it's so dusty. I'll just... Hmm. Dear me, my skirt. It's suck. Look at help. Uh-oh. I can't pull it out. Uh-oh. Look, enter the password. Stop this machine. But I don't know it, Mommy. Okay, we gotta enter this in. Okay, L-A-R-A. -A, Lara is what you have to input. Thank goodness, Mommy. Luca, Luca. Wow, that was close. So, we altered history, I hope? Because in the present future, at the moment, Lara's crippled by that machine. She can't walk. That's why she sits in the chair. I'm pretty sure I mentioned that, but uh, I'll just say it here again. What's Robo up to? Luke, you got a kind heart. You're always thinking of others. This is for you. It's a piece of amber I created using the sap from a tree in my forest. It took 400 years and a lot of pressure to make. I hope you find it useful. Green dream. Tim, you're so sweet. <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, that's it for that little uh, side quest. Um, we can uh, check out Fiona's shrine here some more. These nuns sell stuff. Yeah, mm-hmm. This one here. She sells all the, the stuff here. Visual hats protect status. That's a pretty good item. But I'm going to leave it for now. I don't really need it. Okay. Since the prism helms do the exact same thing. Oops. I did not want to do that. Okay, we need to head to the uh, future. Because there's some stuff here we can do. I said we need to head to the future. Alright. There's also some uh, armor in the past that we can get. Ruby armor or something. Yeah, I'll go here. 
But this is going to have to wait till next time, guys. Next episode, we're going to enter into the Sun Palace. So Godspeed, stay frosty. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye, guys.